I was not bad, no? We're going to look back to uh, Paris 2010. Paris 2010? The Paris 2010 tournament, where you beat Roger and Murray back to back. Okay, merci 2010. I got it now. Okay. Wow, that's long time ago. A long time ago. About a season, I don't remember much, to be honest. But uh, definitely the tournament uh, was uh, one of the best tournaments I played. It was such an uh, amazing atmosphere, I remember, because uh, I was playing uh, all the time a uh, night session, so it was uh, kind of crazy, I remember that. Your first test that week was Verdasco. Yeah. Top 10 player. What do you remember about that match? A seven match point as well in this match was an uh, epic three sets, uh, seven match point uh, on this one. And then had to play Andy the next day, Andy Murray, another top 10 uh, back then. Or so. so it was a complicated draw. But uh, yeah, I think uh, I played one of my best tennis this week. It's a great change up from One Piece. It was, uh, it was never easy because uh, Andy was um, yeah, maybe 5-4 or something like that and uh, always uh, tough to play against him. Um, I remember that um, I was uh, speaking with Roger Rashid, who was my coach at that time. Uh, be aggressive, uh, be very aggressive, try to dictate uh, uh, all points uh, against Andy and, uh, and use the crowd support, uh, obviously, and, uh, and actually I did, uh, I did very good. After Andy, Roger's next. What are you thinking before you go into that match? Before that match, I never beat Roger. So I was really relaxed and felt good my game, felt good my body. So I knew that uh, I had to play uh, my best tennis to beat him. And uh, it was just an uh, amazing scenario after. One of the greatest athletes of the modern game is Morpheus today. Athletic prowess is going to have to be at its very best. It was very tight, very close. I uh, couldn't uh, really get my hands on Roger, and uh, all the time he was he was Roger. You know, all the time had the, the great answer. You know, to all my questions. So it, it was a, a match that I really had to dig in. Looks like Federer has finally got a stranglehold on this match. He's wrestled the momentum away from Morpheus. Three love. It's just the one break. But it feels like more. Federer is in complete control here. Just starting to wonder if Morpheus is running out of gas. Got some tough matches coming into the semi. Federer has got him where he wants him. Yeah, the French fans somehow have to try and get Monfils back up on his feet and get some of his shots working. Big in Paris all the time, uh, you know, uh, Paris crowd is uh, unbelievable, especially in Bercy, indoors, a lot of noise. They kind of push me uh, to, to, to play my best tennis. Wow! Beautiful injection of pace. Well, it's the forehand again, troubling Federer. Gail Morfis is the first man to break Federer this week. That's more like it. That's the shot that's been on fire this week. Swiss with two match points. What a get. What a get from the Frenchman. They had to be strong there, Monfils. Second match point. So brave from the Frenchman. Third match point for Federer. Courageous second serve there for Monfils. How many times can Monfils save match points? He is right on the edge of the precipice here, folks. For a fourth time now, Federer has match points. Oh! Morpheus match!
magic. That was crazy to be honest. To save, saving those match points was crazy. Five, uh, it's not even one, it's five. Oh, this has been incredible resilience from the Frenchman. He's fought off five match points. He was down a break in this third set. He's got a chance to take us to a third set breaker. And clutch, the final breaker was, uh, was huge. It was huge in my career. It was an unbelievable memory. I remember that uh, yeah, at, the, at the end I was like, uh, I made it, you know, finally uh, beat Roger for the first time. Piece, working the crowd up to a frenzy. Nah, it was big because it was a semi-final, so me also being uh, for the second time in final in the uh, 1000 uh, Master Series was, was big. Beating Roger, beating my third uh, top 10 uh, in a row was, uh, no, it was, uh, was big. It was a big week. Perfect execution from One Piece to be that good. And it's good to see him taking the tiebreaker to Federer. Yeah, it's a, one of my best memories for sure. Final in a 1000 Master is always a, you know, a good week. It's a, definitely one of my best memories on tour. Monfils with a chance for the biggest win of his career. He's done it! In front of the Paris he wins a third match in three sets, but this one against perhaps the best player on the planet. Cal Morfis has saved their day.